Hello and welcome. Let's talk about anti-epileptic drugs. So, what are the anti-epileptic drugs? Phenytoin, phosphenytoin, and phenytoin congeners like mephenytoin, ethotoin, phenicamide, carbamazepine, valproic acid, sodium valproate, ethosoximide, phensoximide, and mesoximide. And barbiturates like phenobarbitone, mephobarbital, methylbarbital, and primidone. Benzodiazepines like diazepam, lorazepam, clonazepam, nitrazepam, and clobazepam. And new drugs like bigabatrin, pregabelin, tiagabelin, gabaventin, felbamatin, and others. So, the drugs used in different seizures. In case of partial seizures, peritoin, carbamazepine, valproic acid, and phenobarbitones are used. In case of generalized seizures like tonic clonic, phenytoin, carbamazepine, valproic acid are used. In case of petit mal seizure, ethosoximide is the drug of choice. For myoclonic seizure, valproic acid. For atonic seizure, valproic acid, benzodiazepine. And for infantile seizures, benzodiazepine and corticosteroid is used. Now, phenytoin. It is a diphenyl substituted hydantoin. It is least seductive and the product is phosphenytoin. Pharmacokinetics. It has narrow therapeutic index and it is almost completely absorbed from the GIT and it is highly bound to plasma protein. And plasma half life is 2 to 36 hours. And the primarily it shows first order kinetics and then shows zero order kinetics. And it accumulates in the brain, liver, muscle, and fat. And it can cross the central nervous system. It can produce steep dose response curve. Plasma monitoring is needed and it is metabolized in the liver. It is a potent hepatic enzyme inducer. So, with oral con contraceptives, it leads to therapeutic failure. It uh, contracts with carbamazepine warfarin, steroid, thyroxine and others. It is excreted by kidney and the excretion is dose dependent. Now mechanism of action of phenytoin. It inhibits ionic flux of the sodium, potassium, calcium across the cell membrane. So it inhibits the regeneration of rapidly repetitive action potential and phenytoin finally decreases synaptic release of the glutamate and enhances the release of the GABA. Clinical uses. Partial seizure, generalized tonic-clonic seizure as anti -arrhythmic and in case of the bipolar disorder as a backup. Now, adverse effect. The most common adverse effect into diplopia, ataxia, nystagmus, gingival hyperplasia, histotism, hypersensitivity, impaired cognitive function, and other long term effects, as well as many drug interaction and teratogenicity leading to fetal hydrantoin syndrome, which is a specific syndrome. Now, carbamazepine. It is only oral form available and tricyclic compounds related to imipramine and it is initially used for trigeminal neuralgia. The mechanism of action includes blockage of the sodium channel, so decreases the high frequency repetitive firing of the neuron in X presynaptically to decrease synaptic transmission. Now pharmacokinetics. It is almost completely absorbed and 70% bound to plasma protein. Plasma half-life is 30 hours. There is slow distribution and completely metabolized in liver. It is a potent hepatic inducer and causes drug interaction. Now, clinical uses include partial seizure, generalized tonic clonic seizure, trigeminal neuralgia, and bipolar disorder with mania. Adverse effect includes low incidence of unwanted side effects like sedation, ataxia, mental disturbances, and water retention, rose related diplopia, ataxia, mild GI offsets, unsteadiness, hyponatremia, water intoxication, etc. Hypersensitivity includes exfoliated dermatitis, agranulocytosis, and others. Teratogenic includes craniofacial abnormalities and spina bifida. Valproic acid and sodium valproate. Fatty carbolic acid. Valproic acid is fully ionized at body pH. Mechanism of action includes increase in the GABA concentration by potentiating glutamic acid decarboxylase responsible for GABA synthesis and by inhibiting GABA transaminase responsible for GABA degradation. It blocks sodium channel, blocks NMDA receptor mediated excitation. Now, pharmacokinetics. Well absorbed from GIT by ability more than 80%, 90% bound to plasma protein, highly ionized so extracellular distribution and others. Clinical uses: absent seizure, generalized tonic-clonic seizure, myoclonus seizure, and few patients with atonic attack, management of bipolar disorder and migraine prophylaxis. Now adverse effect: dose related includes nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, heartburn, fine tremor other hypertoxicity, thrombocytopenia, spinobifida and others. Now drug interaction. It inhibits CP450 enzyme, so inhibits metabolism of other drugs and increases toxicity like 
phenobarbitone, phenytoin, and carbamazepine. It displaces phenytoin from plasma protein. Now, ethosuximide. It is 2-ethyl, 2-methyl succinimide. Mechanism of action is in which type, T type of calcium channel mainly in thalamus. The absorption is complete and it is not protein bound. Serum half life is 40 hours. It is completely metabolized. Clinical uses include absent seizure, which is the drug of choice, and it is highly efficacious and safe drug. Adverse effects include nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, transient lethargy, fatigue, headache, dizziness, skin rash, acidity, etc. Now, phenobarbital. It is the oldest currently available drug and is the most commonly used barbiturate. Mechanism of action includes enhanced GABA receptor mediated current by prolonging the opening of the chloride channel. It inhibits calcium channel, inhibits sodium channel, and it blocks excitatory responses induced by glutamate. Clinical uses include partial seizure, generalized tonic-clonic seizure. Benzodiazepines. This play a prominent role in the therapy of epilepsy. Diazepam and lorazepam and clonazepam. Diazepam and lorazepam is very effective in febrile conversion in children. Clonazepam is a backup drug in absence seizure and myoclonic seizure. Lamotrigine is like phenytoin and that broad therapeutic efficacy. Mechanism of action includes it inhibits voltage and uses the sodium dependent channel. It also inhibits voltage activated calcium channel and decreases synaptic release of glutamate. It is excreted by kidney. Clinical uses include partial seizure, absence seizure, and myoclonic seizures. Adverse effects include dizziness, nausea, vomiting, headache, diplopia, somnolence, and hypersensitivity reaction. Gabapentin and pregabalin. GABA analog having analgesic property and pregabalin is product. Mechanism of action includes increases GABA concentration by modifying synaptic or non-synaptic release of GABA. Inhibits voltage gated calcium channel and express synaptically to decrease release of glutamate. Pharmacokinetics includes absorb orally and excreted on change in urine. Clinical uses include partial seizures, generalized tonic clinic seizures, adverse effects include somnolence, indigenous ataxia, headache, and tremor. Thiagabin. Mechanism of action is the increased concentration of GABA by inhibiting GABA uptake in urine and glia. Increased action of the GABA released GABA. And clinical uses include partial seizure as in therapy. Adverse effects include nervousness, dizziness, tremor, psychosis, depression. Copyramate includes body spectrum and the mechanism of action is blocks voltage gated sodium channel, potentiate GABA action, inhibits excitatory reaction of glutamate receptor. Clinical uses include partial seizure and generalized stone chronic seizures, absent seizures, and migraine. Adverse effects include somnolence, fatigue, dizziness, cognitive slowing, and paresthesia. Thalamate, analog of the meprobamate and limited use due to toxicity and is a third line drug. Bigger battery also enhances the effects of the GABA and mechanism of action is decreases the breakdown of the GABA by irreversible inhibition of the GABA amino transferase. Increased release of the GABA at synaptic site decreases the blend glutamate synthetic activity or increases GABA level and clinical uses include partial seizure and waste syndrome. Adverse effects include drowsiness, dizziness, weight gain, agitation, confusion, psychosis, visual field effect in long term. Now, general principles of treating a case of the epilepsy. No single drug is appropriate for all types of epilepsy. Polypharmacy is not appreciable. Different drug is suitable for different types of epilepsy. Maintain an epileptic card. And while starting the treatment with the drug, should be in low dose. Then see the clinical symptoms. Then gradually increase the dose. Observe and continue for 3 to 5 years. If no seizure occurs, then gradually withdraw the drug for 3 months. If seizure does not occur within 5 years, then no treatment. If seizures occur, then restart the treatment. Address the patient to avoid fire, drowning, and physical exercise. The goal of the treatment is restoration of the normal EEG, prevention of recurrent. The rational use of the evaluative drugs includes increased inhibitory trans neurotransmission, blocking of the ionic conductance, and decrease in the excitatory neurotransmission. Duration of the anti epileptic drugs is for one year, 60 to 90 percent is completely cured, and three to four years if seizure continues. Withdrawal of the drug for at least two years, preferably three to four years. 20% relapse occurred during withdrawal, and further 20% relapse over the following five years. Now, status epilepticus treatment: diazepam or lorazepam, most effective. Total dose 20 to 30 mg, phosphophenytoin, phenobarbital, lidocaine, and general anesthetic agent in high resistant cases. Drugs in favor of conversion for Six years of the age, they do not develop epilepsy. Drugs include digipam, which is the drug of the choice, paracetamol, water, sponging. Now, contraception with anti-epileptic drugs. 
antibiotic drugs include CP 450 enzymes so decreases the pharmaceutical effects of the OCP thereby therapeutic failure and of course leading to preg pregnancy so should be used different methods of contraception which drugs should be chosen in pregnancy all drugs are teratogenic pregnancy should be avoided during the treatment and carbamazepine may be considered with folic acid lamotrigine can be also be given teratogenic effects of the antibiotic drugs includes cleft palate cleft lip heart abnormalities fetal hydrantoin syndrome spina bifida and decreased in clotting factors end of the topic